to Sydney and I just had a missed call from you. There's no keys with the vehicle and from my understanding I guess there was supposed to be a wedding dress according to the news. Yes. Yeah, there's, that's not in here either. Turner says her car was stolen from her driveway on Sunday night while she was just steps away inside her home. I feel so invaded. So kind of like a sickening, nauseating feeling. Her daughter says she was planning on saving the dress for when her daughter got married. So many memories and something you want to hold on to for sure. But what Sydney didn't know is that her wedding wouldn't be the last time she saw that dress. Thank you, sir. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Wow. Well, <laughs> how does that end your story? And that call led us right here in East Lubbock, where a farmer says he saw the stolen car on his property and alerted LPD. Now the car was found with a purse and credit cards inside, but no keys and no wedding dress. This was not, this isn't ours. So obviously they were doing, like the policeman said, they stole my car to commit other crimes. Well, an officer down the road discovered a dress bag in the street next to another stolen car. I thought it was going to be covered in mud got a little bit right here. The family says they're not sure how much damage has been done to the car, but they're choosing to look for the silver lining in it all. Back in, we found mama's wedding dress. Yay! Leah Doherty, KLBK News.